Fifth is the ability of a material to resist externally applied forces with breakdown or yielding. The stiffness is the ability of material to resist deformation under stress. This is the true. The ability of material to resist fracture due to high impact loads is called as roughness. The property of material which enables to retain the deformation permanently is called as plasticity. <coughs> the ductility is the property of material due to which it can be drawn into weights. The malleability is the property of material due to which it can be rolled or hammered into the sheets. I agree. Which of the following property is desirable for material used tools and machines with elasticity? The property of material necessary for forgings in stamping images on coins and organ metal work is plasticity. Which of the following property is desirable in a part subjected to shock and impact loads is the toughness. The property of material essentially of a spring material is their resiliency. The toughness of material when it is heated decreases. Which of the following material has the maximum ductility? Mild steel. Brittle material when subjected to tensile load snap off without giving any sensible elongation. Yes. The property of material due to which it breaks with little permanent distortion is called as brittleness. The oddness is the property of material due to which it can cut another metal. Cast iron is a ductile metal is from which of the following material has the maximum malleability? Lead. The, the ability of material to absorb energy in the plastic range is called as resiliency. The malleability is the property of material by virtue of which a material can be rolled or hammered into thin sheets. The ability of material to undergo large permanent de uh, deformation with the applications of tensile force is called ductility. Correct. The stiffness is the ability of material to resist deformation under stress. Iron ore is usually found in the form of hall of the above. The iron ore mostly used for production of the pig iron is uh, hematite. Hematite iron ore contains iron about 70%. Blast furnace is used to produce pig iron. Uh, smelting is the process of reducing the ore with carbon in the presence of flex. The approximate height of a blast furnace is 30 m. The maximum internal diameter of blast furnace is about 9 m. The portion of the blast furnace above weirdest cross section is called a slag. The portion of the blast furnace below widest cross section is called as Bosch. The charge of the blast furnace consists of calcium ore 8 parts and coke 4 parts and limestone is the 1 part. The charge is fed into blast furnace through the throat. In the lower part of blast furnace, the temperature is 1200 degrees to 1300 degrees. In the middle part of the blast furnace, zone of absorption temperature is 800 degrees to 1000 degrees. The temperature is upper part of blast furnace, zone reduction is dash for that, but the mild part is less than. The fuel used in the blast furnace is coke. The coke is charge of blast furnace, supplies heat to reduce or and melt the iron. The iron ore in the charge blast furnace acts as the iron bearing material, is it true? The limestone is the charge of blast furnace becomes uh, to give lime and carbon dioxide that lime the sobre, forms a slag by combining with impurities. The slag from the blast furnace, all of the above. In iron, the presence of carbon free form is called as graphite. Agree. The carbon in the pig iron varies from 1 to 55 percent. The cupola is used to manufacture cast iron. Free carbon and iron makes the metal soft and gives a coarse grain and crystal structure. Combined carbon and iron makes the metal hard and give fine grain crystal structure. The percentage of carbon in cast iron varies from 1.7 to 4.5. Cast iron is manufactured in copola. Cast iron is a dash brittle material. Cast iron is used to those parts which are subjected to shocks. Brand. Cast iron has all of this. The steel scrap added in the charge of cupola controls the grade of cast iron produces correct. The compressive strength of cast iron is that of sensor strength is the more than. Silicon in cast iron makes the iron soft and easily machinable. Sulfur in cast iron increases hardness and brittleness. Chilled cast iron is produced by quick cooling of molten cast iron. 
white cation has a high tension strength and low compressive strength yes nodular cation is produced by adding to the molten iron molten cation is magnesium malleable cation is produced from white cation by annealing force when elements like nickel chromium copper and molybdenum added the molten molten cast iron is produces nodular cast iron the addition of magnesium to cast iron increases its creep strength which of the following uh, impurity in cast iron makes a hard material sulfur gray cast iron has carbon in the form of free graphite when filling or machining cast iron makes our hand black and shown is the represent the cast iron free graphite according to hindian standard specification cast iron designated by fg150 means gray cast iron 150 mpa as minimum tensile strength white cast iron has all of this according to indian standard specification so sg400 by 15 means spheroidal graphite cast iron with uh, minimum tensile strength 400 mpa and 15% elongation which of the following impurity in cast iron promote graphite nodule formation and increases the fluidity of the molten metal silicon which of the following statement is correct the chilled cast iron has no graphite gray cast iron is then the white cast iron is softer spheroidal gray cast iron has graphite flex true which of the following display property similar uh, to that of steel uh, black hot cast iron and white cast iron a and b for pipe fitting like elbow <coughs> t union etc which of the following perfect malleable iron the percentage of carbon content in wrought iron is about 0.02 wrought iron all of this steel containing up to 0.15% carbon is known as dead metal steel steel containing 0.8 to 1.5 carbon is known as high carbon steel according to indian standard specification a plain carbon steel designated by 40c8 means that carbon contains 0.35 to 0.45 the brown smoke during the operation of bismuth converter indicates that the air is burning uh, out silicon and mang uh, manganese the steel produced by uh, cementation process is known as steel blister uh, during operation of uh, bismuth converter the white flame indicates the silicon and manganese hand burnt and carbon has started oxidizing agree the red flame during the operation of a uh, bismuth converter indicates that the red flame does not occurs during the operation of bismuth converter in acidic bismuth process the furnace is lined with uh, silica bricks in the basic bismuth process the furnace is lined with a mixture of tar and burnt uh, dolomite bricks which are the following process of steel making in operation tata iron and steel works jamshedpur the duplex uh, process the duplex process of steel making a combination of acid bismuth and basic open heart process the phosphor and sulfur steel making can be removed by using basic bismuth process is correct the steel produced by bismuth or open heart process or to the produced by ld process in inferior the element the electric process of steel making is especially adapted to all of this which of the following steel making process is being adapted to a rurkela steel plant ld process silicon is added in low carbon steel make the steel tough and harder phosphor is added in low carbon steel to raise its yield point through Uh, manganese is added low carbon steel is the make the steel ductile and good bending qualities which of the following is added low carbon steels prevent them from uh, becoming a process the silicon in low carbon steels raise the yield point the improved resistance atmospheric origin is the phosphorus which of the following when used ordinary low carbon steel makes metal ductile of good bending qualities is the manganese a low carbon steel presence of small quantity of sulfur improves machinability a carbon steel having a brinell hardness number 100 should have ultimate tensile strength closer to 315 nm square a steel alloy containing 36% nickel is called as inver the material widely used for making a pendulum of clocks nickel steel In high speed steel, manganese is used to tougher the metal to increase the critical temperature.